Hey guys, Shane Starnes with DroidMotorX.com. I have some very exciting news for you all today. The very first custom ROM has been released for the Verizon HTC One M8. Now this is a ROM that's been running on other variants of the HTC One M8, but it is finally coming to our devices thanks to Team Venom who have released the Viper ROM. Now I ran this on my last HTC One. I ran it on the Droid DNA, and I really did love this ROM, mostly because it's one of the best, most customizable ROMs available uh, for any device. So the way that you would install this, you'll need to download it from the link in the description. Uh, you'll find the Viper One M8 ROM. This includes all the G apps, so you don't have to flash those separately. And then, of course, you'll want to go ahead and boot into recovery. So you can boot into recovery one of a few different ways. I'm just going to reboot into recovery through this Flashify application. Um, alternatively, you could turn the device off and hold... Uh, power and volume down until the screen goes black release power continuing to hold volume down That'll also get you into recovery mode. Okay, so from here uh, you want to make sure that you do back up your device So you would click backup swipe to backup. I already have a backup saved on my device uh, This is a full Android backup. So if something goes wrong during the flash uh, MD5 is not correct or the size of the file is incorrect. It's an incomplete file Whatever the case may be you can always get back into recovery and restore your Nandroid backup so once you're finished with that, we'll wipe. And this is going to wipe data cache and Dalvik cache. We'll go ahead and swipe to wipe. Give that just a few minutes to do its thing. Then we'll go back. We'll go to install. This should be on your SD card if you downloaded it directly to your device in the download folder. And then we're just looking for the Viper 1 M8. And swipe to flash. So the installation process will be similar on every ROM. Not every ROM is going to include the Aroma installer. This one does. It just allows you to further customize your device before you ever boot into the ROM itself. Uh, so here you'll need to agree to the license. So you'll check I agree and click next. This is a, they suggest you make a backup of your phone. Okay, and then it says, I was asking you what you would like to do. We'll just install the Viper 1 ROM. And I've already wiped data, so we're going to install without wiping. And we'll go with the Viper look. This is going to add a customized theme. It'll be optimized uh, and should run faster and have better performance. Okay, this is where you can put on uh, your extras. So you can just kind of select what you like. Okay, so I selected to be able to uninstall applications, and it brought up this window here. So we'll just uh, click the ones that we don't want. Okay, and then select Next. Okay, then you can choose a custom keyboard. Then we're going to go with the default variant for the custom carrier tweaks. Okay, so it's going to go ahead and install the ROM. We'll give it just a few minutes, and then we will reboot into the ROM. Okay, so when all that's done, uh, you'll get this screen here. It says new ROM flash successfully. We'll go ahead and select next and reboot your device. We'll select finish. And there you have it. The Team Venom uh, Viper ROM is now successfully installed on your Verizon HTC One M8. If you guys like this video, be sure to subscribe to this channel. I will be including a full review of this ROM over the next week or so after I've had a chance to really use it. So you'll definitely want to be sure to subscribe for that. Also, be sure to share this video if it helps you in any way. It helps me more than you know when you guys share my content. You can find more of me at DroidMotorX.com. I'll have the latest in Android and tech news. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.